The large stakeholders meeting is the first since the inauguration of the Governor Emeka Heriaha led administration. Individuals and representatives of various social political, religious, and business groups, as well as state government functionaries, are here at the Governor's invitation to take stock and x ray the progress made by the current administration. This is just a great opportunity for us to say to ourselves. We have retaken our state back and we are determined to rebuild it and move it forward. Governor Mekai Hedioha dances his way to the stage. He recalls his commitment to run an open and transparent administration towards actualizing his development agenda. We have been seven months in this job seven months by 29th, by the strength and the enlightenment of God who have not met on our state dead mission. The greatest asset of our state is not in its government and not in its material endowment, but in its people. The governor insists his administration is still on course with a vision to make the state economy one of their best by 2025. We also set out to achieve this by leveraging our abundant human capital and natural resources to build an economy anchored on good governance, wealth creation, value for money, and rule of law. For some people, the reassurance from the governor is a sign that Imo State is on the path to greatness. Yeah, the emergence has given hope to Imo people. He has started justifying the trust and you know making people to have confidence once again in governance. It's not about physical infrastructure, which he's doing, but it's about the trust we as leaders from Imo have in him. Imo is on its way forward. You can see government and governance, you know, in action. This is very commendable having this town hall meeting of stakeholders of Imo State coming together. So you see now that Imo is back to the people. The state government promises to convene this meeting periodically to intimate the people on its activities and seek advice where necessary in the interest of the state.